The best type of wood to bend is hardwood. Its fibers react better to heat and moisture than softwood fibers do and therefore curve nicely. If you bend softwood, it wrinkles. The wood first goes into an outdoor dryer to bring its humidity level down to between 15 and 20 percent. This prevents the wood from expanding and contracting after it's bent. This air drying process takes up to a week. Once the wood is dry, a powerful trimmer saws the pieces to the required length, an edger to the required width. Now that the wood pieces are the right dimensions, they go into what's called a steaming box. This superficially rehumidifies them so that they become somewhat flexible. This takes from 10 to 45 minutes depending on the type of wood and its thickness. This humidity will later evaporate out of the wood. Now the pieces go into a press sandwiched between two forms in the shape of the curve to be made. The press applies both pressure and heat. Pressure to bend the wood. Heat generated by a high voltage electric current to cure it, setting the new shape. How long the pieces stay in the press depends again on the species and dimensions. Generally, it takes from 20 minutes to an hour. Making this particular type of curve is called crown bending. Workers measure each piece against the template to ensure the curve is just right. The factory uses the same process to bend these pieces into a different shape. It's critical to use just the right amount of heat and pressure. Too high a temperature would burn the wood. Too much force would crack it. These straight pieces of wood will become the rounded backs of Windsor-style chairs, which is why this type of bending is called Windsor bending. Workers humidify the wood in the steaming box, but will shape the pieces using a pressure-only process. They mount what's called a bending mold onto a hydraulic press. This machine uses just pressure to bend the wood around the mold. No heat this time to immediately set the shape. Instead, once the press curves the pieces, workers hook up a chain to temporarily hold the shape. Then they transfer the bent pieces to a heated indoor dryer. The drying process takes between two days and two weeks, depending as before on the type of wood and the dimensions. Once the wood dries out, the curve is permanent. There are many wooden products that require bent components. This wheel for a horse-drawn carriage, for example. Back to the Windsor chairs now. A dowel machine rounds off the bent pieces. Before shipping the pieces out, workers run them through a sander. This prepares them for the furniture factories whole varnish or stain and varnish them. Upon receiving these chair backs, the furniture factories will assemble them to the straight parts of the Windsor chairs.